This is GoMarquette.com, and this is the head coach of the Marquette men's soccer team, Louis Bennett. A 2-2 draw today against one of the top teams in the Big East, the Louisville Cardinals. After the first 20 minutes, it, this one looked pretty scary, Louis. You had Callum Malice get an early booking, and you gave up two early goals, one on a penalty kick. But your lads just fought back today. Just a, a, an amazing effort in the second half. And really, you held a run of play in the second overtime as well. I, I think you have to be impressed with your guys' poise. And with this experienced group, I'm sure you're not surprised, but you still have to be happy with the effort. Um, yeah, I'm happy with the effort. I'm happy, you know, we, we managed to get uh, crawl out of the huge hole that we dug in the first 20, 25 minutes and that we played with some character. We played with a little bit of uh, poise and we did what it took to get a result. And at the beginning of this week, and if you'd have said you're going to get four points, four points was our bare minimum. We wanted to get six. The end of the game, you know, and when you look back at it, uh, that first 25 minutes, we gave the game away and then we took it back. Um, I'm not very happy about the first 25 minutes, but neither are our guys. You know, we kind of froze a little bit. Some of that uh, inexperience raised its ugly head. We weren't, we didn't recognize ourselves. There wasn't a lot of movement off the ball. We gave a, f a penalty up in the first four minutes. A little bit of anxious defending. So everything that possibly could have gone wrong against the number nine ranked team in the country went wrong. We didn't look, we just didn't look ourselves. And then piece by piece, we managed to get through that first half. And then after some, uh, um, some tactical adjustments in the sec uh, uh, for the second half and some mental adjustments. I think we crawled our way back in and uh, given the opportunity, Billy Von Rien did a great job of keeping the ball on frame. Um, I don't know if it took a, a slight deflection, but it went in. Uh, and then we stayed in patient enough. We changed the formation um, with the, what was it, with 10 minutes or nine minutes to go uh, and put four guys up front, two strikers, and uh, let Callum hang just behind. And Scott Miller, on his own, managed to grab the, uh, grab the midfield. Um, and I thought that we, we executed that very well. And we got two opportunities. And Emilcar Herrera um, popped his head up and did what counts and scored the goal. Um, and then in the, in the second half uh, of overtime, it got a little ragged. First half, I think it was both ways. So, you know, all in all, I think we earned a point. Last question for you, Lou, as we dodge the raindrops here at Valley Fields. What do you look forward to going forward here? You've got a, a big couple-week stretch coming up in terms of Big East games. Yeah, I think it's, uh, this week we've got work to do, and this week we'll have a good, solid week's work so we can really prepare well for West Virginia. I mean, that's a huge game that's in our division now. We're starting divisional work, and we've picked up, what, some bonus points, uh, and that's really important. We picked up, what, five five bonus points. So we're going into our divisional play with five points, and uh, now we want to every, – every game we play, it knocks one guy further down. It, every game we win, it knocks one team further down, and we get above it, and that's what we're – you know, that's what we're about, about being effective. The rain falls in our video, and the rain was good to you this week, Lou. Both Friday night's game and today's game played in and out of raindrops, and you do come away with four points. Today it was a 2-2 draw against the Louisville Cardinals. Lou, thanks for joining us on GoMarquette.com. Thanks, Fife.